Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to walk through the SIM card manager and see what options are available when you are trying to use two SIM card with one physical SIM and one embedded SIM on the Samsung Galaxy S22 series. First, to get to this page, tap on the home button at the bottom to go back to the home screen. And on the home screen, Swipe down at the top and tap on the settings icon. In settings, go down and tap on connections. Then swipe up to go down and tap on SIM card manager. Now, if you have already set up a physical SIM card and eSIMs, this is what your phone should look like. Now at the top here, there is a toggle button that I can turn on or turn off the physical SIM. And if I turn it on, on the left hand side, it will show the phone number of the SIM card. And if I tap on the panel in here, I'm, I can also turn on or turn off the SIM card. Now I can tap on icon down here to change the SIM card. So this is the SIM card icon that I can change. I can change the name of the SIM card. home sim and then tap on done so you can also change the name of your sim card now you can also turn on or turn off your eSIM as well so tap on the switch will allow you to turn them on or off and then tap on ok and this will allow you to turn on or turn off your sim card All right the same with eSIM in here you have the option to change the SIM card icon. You can change the name of your eSIM. If you tap on more information, it will give you some information about your eSIM. And you can also remove your embedded SIM. All right, and down here, you can see here in here, it has the option to add in even more SIM. So I can tap on add mobile plan to add in uh, more eSIMs and down here in the prefer SIM card I can choose between my physical SIM so the first the primary SIM and the secondary SIM uh, I can choose always ask always ask so that is uh, to set the prefer SIM card for calls and messages and for mobile data I can choose which SIM card to use for mobile data. Now there is an auto data switching. I can tap on it to turn it on. And it said that switch to another SIM for mobile data if the preferred SIM can't connect. If Wi-Fi calling is on, SIMs will also be able to make and see receive calls when they are out of network range. The calls will go through the mobile data connection of another SIM. So basically, um, this one here, if you if your first SIM uh, with, is on a call with someone else, then your phone will automatically switch to use the second SIM for mobile data. And lastly, there is a more SIM card settings. If we tap on that, in here we've got call settings for two SIM, always on. So you can turn this uh, feature on. So what this two SIM always on uh, do is that um, if you are on a call with the first SIM, then when someone tries to call a second SIM, that SIM will immediately use the phone number that you have set in here and forward that call to that set number. So it is very much like a call forwarding uh, service. So if your phone uh, is busy and uh, you are already on the first SIM, then the second SIM will get forwarded to a different phone number. And in here, you can choose lock mobile plan settings. Use your uh, screen lock to protect your mobile plan settings. So what you can do on the screen lock. And in here, you can remove all mobile plans. So I'm just gonna cancel that. I will not remove the mobile plans for now. And that is everything's inside your SIM card manager and how you can manage your SIM card. Finally, you can tap on the home button to go back to the home screen. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.